What is Samsung's strategy in the solar industry? Well, as you mentioned, that Samsung is pretty good in the semiconductor as well as LCD. And if you take a look at the technology that is needed in solar, all the component that we have is coming from the semiconductor and LCD, which is very close to the technology that is needed in solar, especially in the crystalline silicon. The technology for solar in crystalline silicon is very similar to that of uh, the semiconductor. And in terms of thin film, thin, thin film uh, solar, it is almost exactly the same as LCD. So we do have all the components that needed to be competitive for solar business in a short period of time. So we, we are planning to have a very good leading edge of technology as well as cost effectiveness in the solar. Okay, that's our strategy. From a, from a commitment point of view to, to the industry, I mean, uh, how much, how much capital expenditure are, uh, are you targeting for your, solar, uh, for your solar businesses? Okay, so up to 2020, we are planning to spend $6 billion for solar business. So, yeah. And, and this is uh, uh, focused specifically on crystalline technology, or uh, will you be branching into thin film due to your experience in the LCD manufacturing? So currently, we are focusing on the crystalline silicon business, especially on the monocrystalline silicon. Uh, however, we are starting there any uh, option to uh, for the thin film technology. So we are exploring uh, any possible option for a thin film business uh, opportunity in near future. Now, um, obviously, uh, you mentioned six billion dollars uh, uh, in capital expenditures uh, yeah, through through the next few years. Um, what top, uh, type of uh, megawatt of capacity uh, do you expect to reach uh, uh, with with that spending? So currently, uh, we are uh, doing some kinds of pilot business scale of the, our capacity. However, in near future, uh, it will expand into uh, several uh, megawatts, followed by several gigawatts in a near future. So, based on the expand, expand uh, capital expansion that I mentioned, that we will have uh, that kinds of. Uh, uh, planning to expansion. Now, obviously, uh, you're tapping into your years of experience from the semiconductor industry, uh, especially with process technologies. What sort of uh, uh, cell efficiencies with your monocrystalline uh, uh, cells do you expect to achieve? Well, uh, as all the people in the solar area wants to have a uh, very high efficiency. Uh, Samsung is the same as that. However, on the other hand, we like to pursue another track of uh, low cost with high efficiency. So we are focusing on low cost uh, with higher efficiency solution at this moment. And um, obviously, uh, yeah, this is uh, very early days for Samsung, but uh, can you give us an idea of uh, what you expect to have achieved by the end of this year? Well, end of this year, uh, well, we are hoping to have a very good uh, early stage of the track record of the in solar area. Uh, since we are relative newcomer in here, so our goal for end of this year is to get a very good acceptance from our uh, customer as well as track record. 